Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel for another video. Welcome to my channel if you are new. We're doing a meal prep video today. I know I have been lagging on this video for so long. I did one of these last year and it turned out to be like my most popular video. I know that everyone is always trying to like lose weight and shape up and eat healthier and just find out different like variations of food and stuff. So these are actually like pretty popular videos. I'm excited to bring you guys my second meal prep video ever. I'm gonna be showing you guys everything that I prepped for the week for lunch. I'm not gonna show you my dinners and I will tell you why. Um, but yeah, this is how I've been losing weight. If you haven't been following my journey, I'm down like almost 14 pounds and I drink a lot of water every single day. I eat like this, like these are the meals that I constantly do. And then I have started taking um, a new women's supplement stack. It just helped so very much to just kick off like once I started taking that and I was plateaued at like 10 pounds, I got up to 13 pounds. And it's also helped with muscle definition. So it is the Bliss Go Pack here, which I talked about in my previous video. I don't wanna sell the shit out of this to you guys, but like you'll know once you get it, you'll see your results and it'll sell itself. But I do have a video review on it, so I will link that down below. And I am doing this video with my good friend Kate, um, Kate Nicole. If you guys can hear Christian, he's playing with his little toy over here that sings to him and he sings back to it. It's so cute. Um, I'm doing this video with Kate. We've been trying to get a collab together for so long. She's so beautiful. I know you're already subscribed to her. Um, she is like up on her YouTube game, puts up videos all the time. She has a beauty channel with like really awesome makeup tutorials, but I know she's getting more into like meal prep and stuff like that. So she's going to be showing you a whole different variation of what she's eating this week. So I'm going to leave her channel and her video link down below. Do not forget to subscribe to her. You're going to love her. You're welcome. Like she is beautiful and she's amazing. So please show her some love. Okay, so let's get into what I've been eating and I will show you the lunches. And this is the reason I'm not gonna show you guys the dinners because I've been having a shake for dinner. I know what you're thinking, like girl, don't you push one of those other like Herbalife or like meal replacement shakes. Like I was never into those, you guys, ever. We know I love my food. We know I like to feel full and like have a big meal. And I never thought that a meal replacement shake would like fill me up till I bought this. So this is the level one protein by First Form, um, and the uh, flavor is an ice cream sandwich. So I'll mix this with a little bit of almond milk, a banana, and then some peanut butter or like some PB2, which is just like powdered peanut butter. It's so filling, it tastes like a chocolate peanut butter smoothie. It's absolutely amazing. That's what I've been having on my weight loss journey for dinner. It's really great. I'll show you in the video how to make it. I do have a deal for you guys to get free shipping and the best deal on any type of like first form products like this or that weight loss stack I was talking about. So it's a lot of stuff that I'm gonna mention in the video, but everything will be listed in the down bar for like easy access for you guys. And yeah, okay, let's get into my meals. So to give you guys an idea of what I do eat for breakfast, it's usually egg whites with reduced sugar ketchup, some everyday essentials turkey bacon, and then sometimes I'll have a Chobani yogurt instead of the turkey bacon. It's very filling and it does fit my macros very well, so I really love that. And then for today, we're going to be making the Jenny O ground turkey. I like to get the one that's um, seasoned. And then we're going to be making Brussels sprouts, and we're also going to be making asparagus, but these are also some good canned food options. If you don't have those other fresh veggies, it's totally fine. So we'll start off with the Brussels sprouts. I just basically lay them down on a pan, and then I put a little bit of olive oil, but olive oil does have a lot of calories, so I only do like a light drizzle. And then I personally like to season mine with pink Himalayan salt. I found this one here at Target, and then I also really love the Mrs. Dash Original because it's all herbs and there's no calories in it. Um, and I do the exact same thing here for the asparagus, and I do set the oven for these ones at about 350 degrees, and I only bake them for like 12 minutes, otherwise they do tend to get burned. And I have burned them a few times because I've forgotten to put on the timer, so I always try to put the oven timer on there. So I'm basically just seasoning these as well, and then I'm going to go ahead and pop them in the oven. Um, so yeah, like I said, I set it here for 350 or 375, and then I only cook them for like less than 15 minutes. So I'm just going to pop those on two oven racks. I like to cook them at the same time. If there's nothing else in the oven, there's no reason that you can't just like pop them in there at the same time. So while all the veggies are cooking there, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys that shake that I do have for dinner as my like meal replacement shake. So I use a little bit of egg whites. I use some almond milk. And then I do use that protein I was talking about. And I also want to let you guys know, I'm just going to blend this up in this new blender that I have. It's called the Boss Blender by Braville. You guys, this blender, I could sell the shit out of it. It's amazing. It's so much better than like the Ninja or anything like that because it really blends everything up into super fine particles. And you can do juicing. You can do um, like fruits and vegetables in there. You can do your protein shakes. You can also do cocktails like... 
it will blend up ice so smoothly that you can make like margaritas and everything. It's literally the best high quality blender that I've ever owned. Um, I know they have a website and also you can get it at like Bath and, uh, Bed Bath & Beyond and stuff like that. And you can change the speeds and everything. Like it's legit amazing and it comes with a cookbook as well. So it'll give you like a ton of recipes you can do and it has an amazing warranty. Um, I personally, I hated my last blender. So I'm like selling the crap out of this one because I truly, truly love it. It's really um, high quality, which I just like really appreciate because I blend stuff now like every day. So it's super easy and it cleans really well. If you have been needing any type of new blender, of course, with the protein and everything like that, I will leave a link down below just so you guys can check it out. So I'm just basically blending up all those ingredients I told you before along with a few ice cubes and then we have the perfect consistency for my dinner shake. So while all those veggies continue um, cooking, I'm just going to go ahead and put some fruit here. I did already wash my hands and then I washed all the apples as well. I'm just slicing them up into like really small pieces or like medium size and then I also had some watermelon as well. I'm just throwing those in another one of those glass um, Tupperware containers just so they're easy if I do leave the house or I'm on the go. I don't have to pick up chips or something bad. I'll just have these ready. So I'm basically just popping those in there. And then you'll see a clip here where I'm going to go ahead and take all the veggies out of the oven. They just look really crisp and just like done perfectly to my satisfaction. So yeah, I mean, hello. These look so bomb. Like eating healthy lately to me is just so good. It's not even like a chore. So for the containers where I do not do ground turkey, I'm going to do chicken. This is just a roasted chicken that I picked up at Albertsons. I'm kind of, as you can see there, just taking like the bones and the skin and stuff off and just putting the inner portion of the chicken into my Tupperware containers. I think I did like two or three containers of chicken and then the other ones ended up having the ground turkey. And then I'm going to top all of those with the veggies. So this whole process only takes like an hour, an hour and a half, and you're literally good to go for the whole week. So for me and my schedule, like it's so worth it. Um, and yeah, I just end up loving it. So you will see here the ground turkey was done. Um, it looks really good because it's seasoned with their taco seasoning, which also has no calories, but it has a lot of flavor, so it just turns out really good. This is like a meal that I never get tired of, and I actually make this like week after week. I know I need to switch it up a bit, but this is just something that fits my calorie intake, and it's just really good. So I'm topping all of these with the Brussels sprouts, and then you'll see me do the same thing with the asparagus. And then, yeah, those are done. Like, it's pretty easy, you guys. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this. If you do try it, be sure to post a picture on Instagram or Snapchat or something and tag me. I would love to know that my video or just like, you know, me giving you guys this knowledge has inspired you to meal prep a little bit. And also be sure to check the down bar uh, for all the information on the blender and the protein and the supplements that I'm personally taking just to like speed up my weight loss process and hit my goals because a ton of you always comment that you're doing the same thing and I want you guys to hit your goals as well. So yeah, I'm going to pack this up for the week and I hope you guys have a successful week. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new, please subscribe to my channel and you can follow me on social media for my weight loss progress and all that. And I will see you guys next time.